Hello everyone, in this video I am going to talk about the pencil tool and what it can do. Left click the pencil tool icon to use it with the left mouse button or right click to use it with the right mouse button. Alternatively, you can also use shortcuts P and Alt P for left and right tools respectively. After choosing pencil, you can either draw free hand using the left or right mouse buttons or draw straight lines by holding shift and mouse left or right buttons. You can also snap the angle of the line to 15 degree intervals by holding control along with shift. The size slider controls the stroke size of the brush. By default, its maximum value is 25, but you can still choose large sizes by typing it in manually. Though keep in mind that large brushes can slow down Pixelorama. You can also change the size using the shortcut control and mouse wheel up or down. There are also many types of brushes available such as the regular pixel brush, circle brushes and file and random brush. The file and random brushes are present in the Pixelorama data folder as shown. For file and random brushes, there is also a brush color from slider that controls how much the brush gets its color from the current tool. For reference, here is the comparison between brush color from set to 0, about 50 and 100. If a semi-transparent color is drawn over the other, the color gets alpha blended with the color drawn earlier on the canvas. Overwrite color makes it so that instead of blending, the color is overwritten. Here is a comparison with overwrite color set to off and on. You can also toggle this option temporarily by pressing control. With fill inside enabled, the area enclosed by the stroke is filled automatically. This is useful for drawing quick shapes. The spacing controls the gap between two consecutive strokes. This is useful for doing some dithering, tiling, etc. This along with the fill inside provides a powerful combo. This is everything to know about the pencil tool and I will see you again in the next video.